<sighs> Made it. I bet you're pretty tired. Get plenty of rest. You'll need it for our training tomorrow. Right. Thanks for today, Gohan. See you tomorrow. Okay, Mom. I'm gonna meet Gohan now. See you later. You've been hanging out with Gohan a lot recently, Trunks. You better not be putting yourself in danger. Are you putting yourself in danger? Uh, of course not. <laughs> Is that so? Okay, then. As long as you're going to see him, why not ask Gohan to join us for dinner? We've got more than enough food. That's a great idea, Mom. Gohan will love that. I'll ask him. Okay, bye. Be careful out there. Sorry for the wait, Gohan. You get enough rest yesterday? If not, you're not gonna get as much out of this training as you should. I'm good. All right. I'm sure you know firsthand how strong the androids are. And that's why we need you to become a Super Saiyan as soon as possible. Uh, okay. Let's get right into it. It's gonna be tough, but once you're warmed up, I'll help you out. So, you ready? Yep, let's do this. Okay, here I come. Good, bring it on. Okay, I think you're getting there. Right, I can keep going. Pretty good attack, but it's not gonna help you become a Super Saiyan. Get angry, Trunks. Come on! Pretend I'm an android. Let the rage consume you. Try this one! That's enough for now. Got it. It sure is hard to become a Super Saiyan. I mean, I'm really trying to get angry. <laughs> I never said it would be easy. It's really just a matter of increasing your energy and exploding with rage. Sounds simple, but to actually pull it off, you're gonna need more training. Right. I won't give up. Oh yeah, my mom wanted to know if you'd have dinner with us tonight. You'll come, right? Uh, 
Dinner? Uh, you sure it's okay? Yeah, I think she's already making enough for all of us. I see. Well, if that's the case, then I guess I'll head over. Awesome! Okay, let's get going! I'm back, Mom! And I brought Gohan with me! Glad you're back safe, Trunks! And it's good to see you, Gohan! Yeah, good to see you too. Your timing's impeccable! I just finished preparing dinner! The androids have made it pretty hard to get everything I want. Some ingredients are hard to find. But I try to make up for it with my ability to adapt in the kitchen. I really appreciate this, Bulma. And so, thanks to Bulma's efforts, the three were able to enjoy a nice meal together and relax. Mmm, thanks a lot for the meal. It was delicious. Whoa, you sure can eat a lot, Gohan. Uh, well, it was just so good I couldn't help myself. <laughs> You just like him. Huh? Like who? Seeing you in that outfit, eating like you do. <laughs> you remind me so much of your father. It's almost like he's still here. I wear this as a way to remind myself that I need to be strong, just like him. My dad was a really carefree person. He never let anything get to him. Even my mom chewing him out. That's so true. But that didn't stop him from risking his life, time and time again to protect me and all the people he knew and loved. He was amazing. I want to carry on his legacy and fight for those I care about, for everyone. But I feel there's more I should be doing. Wow, Gohan's amazing. He's such a strong person. You're doing plenty. <laughs> Rumor has it you're out there giving the androids a hard time all on your own. <sighs> I'm impressed. <laughs> Thanks. Trunks is impressed too, and unfortunately, now he thinks this is his fight as well. Go on, tell him. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't know, right? That I'm training to fight the androids? Again? <sighs> you know, it's already pretty late. You must be tired, Gohan. Why don't you just stay the night? Yeah, you should sleep over. Come on, stay, Gohan. Well, I, I am pretty tired. I'll take you up on that offer then. Good. I'll prepare a bed for you. Now, you two go clean yourselves up. You both smell like you've been working out together all day. Mm. Sorry about that. Man, I was freaking out the other day at dinner. I thought my mom figured out we're training together. Well, Trunks, Bulma's one of the smartest people I know. If we keep staying out late, she'll eventually figure out what's going on. Yeah, so what should we do? Well, for starters, we shouldn't train every day. It might be best to incorporate some rest days into our routine. It'll be good for our bodies and prevent Bulma from worrying. Yeah, that's a good idea. Let's do it. Now that I think about it, it'll help me out too, since I'm probably worrying my own mom and grandpa. <laughs> oh yeah, I've been wondering about Chi-Chi and the Ox King. Uh, have you seen them recently? How are they doing? Actually, you know, I haven't been back home since I started fighting the androids on my own. So, uh, I'm not really sure. Oh, okay. Every time I'd come back beaten up and broken from a fight with the androids, my mom would go crazy on me. She'd yell at me and tell me not to fight them. But I can't stop fighting. I have to avenge everyone the androids killed. And I have to protect this planet. That's what Dad would have done. Go on. But honestly, I am worried about how my mom and grandpa are doing. Ha, <laughs> look at me. I guess I'm just as much a worrier as my mom. Haha. <laughs> anyway, 
Enough about me and my family. Let's call it a day, all right? Okay. See you later. Maybe I should go check on Chi-Chi and the Ox King for Gohan. Huh? What's all that noise? What is that? Something's attacking Chi-Chi! Not good. I need to help her. Get back, you mechanical manies! Leave me alone! Chi-Chi, watch out! Trunks, is that you? Yeah, what's with these robots? I'm not sure. They came out of nowhere and started attacking me! Okay, leave this to me. You go find a safe place to hide. No, I can't leave you to fight these things! I'll be fine. Don't worry, I'm a lot stronger than I look. Looks like these things attack anything that moves. Alright, bring it on! Take that! You're nothing compared to the androids! Starting to pay off. Take that, Mosenko! That's all of them. I hope Chi Chi's okay. Take that, Mosenko! Chi-Chi, are you hurt? No, I'm fine. Although I totally could have handled those buckets of bolts on my own. <laughs> Glad to see you're still full of energy. Yeah, I might not look like it, but I've still got some fight left in me. I am glad you showed up. Thanks, Trunks. It was no problem. What were you up to? Me? No, I was just on my way back from checking on the fields. Cool. I'll escort you back to your house then, just in case any more of those robots show up. Really? Well then, escort away, Mr. Bodyguard. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Hey, Trunks, my boy. I really appreciate you saving Chi-Chi. You know, you'd make Vegeta proud. Oh, it was nothing. Nothing? No need to be so modest, Trunks. You fought just like my Gohan when he was little. Uh, really? Oh, uh, that reminds me. I heard you were out there helping Gohan fight those awful androids. You did? Not good, not good. How did he hear about that? If he knows, then my mom might find out. Uh, <laughs> well, you shouldn't believe everything you hear, you know. Oh, uh, so you're not? Well, uh, I guess that's good. Right. Those androids are way too dangerous for a kid like you to fight. I don't even like Gohan fighting them. He was going to be a world-class scholar when he got older. I know how you feel, Chi-Chi, but Gohan's made up his mind. He's our boy, and we should trust him. We just have to hope he stays safe. Gohan doesn't fight because he wants to, but because he has to, and he's still thinking and worrying about you. Uh, at least that's what I think. You're right. Anyway, if you see him, would you please tell him to keep fighting, but to try to come home, like, every once in a while? I will. Okay, well, I'd better head back now. Stay safe, you two. Thanks. Give my regards to Bulma, okay? Have a safe trip back home! Thanks. Oh, uh, could you maybe not tell my mom what you heard about me helping Gohan fight the androids? It'll just stress her out. <laughs> of course! Ah! 
Gohan should really try to visit his family more often. Gohan! Oh, hey Trunks. I thought you went back home for the rest of the day. Actually, I was just visiting your mom and grandpa at their place. Oh really? Why would you do that? You said you were worried, so I went and checked on them. There was a small issue, but they're okay. Small issue? Yeah, some weird machines were attacking your mom, but I took care of them. Really? Oh no, is my mom okay? Yeah, not a scratch on her. That's a relief. Thanks a lot, Trunks. Seriously, if you hadn't been there, there's no telling what might have happened. Um, Chi Chi wanted me to tell you something. She said keep fighting, but try to make it home once in a while. Oh, uh, I can't go right now, obviously, but I guess I'd better start making regular trips back to make sure she's doing okay. She'd like that. Right. Speaking of family, you'd better head back yourself before Bulma starts worrying. True. See you later. If I really want to put everyone at ease, I need to defeat the androids and bring peace back to this world. The area around West City suffered numerous casualties today as the androids continued their rampage. Residents in nearby areas have been ordered to evacuate immediately. Um, Chi Chi wanted me to tell you something. She said keep fighting, but try to make it home once in a while. Mom, just hang on a bit longer. I promise, I'll come back once the androids are gone. The next day, Trunks and Gohan continue their training with a new resolve. Right. Let's begin the training. What are we going to do today? Another sparring match? We can and will do that. But I think we need to focus on making you a Super Saiyan. So let's start there. I'm sorry this isn't going well. I don't think I can become a Super Saiyan today. It's not supposed to be easy. Don't worry. We'll take our time with it. Okay. That explosion. It has to be the androids. I cannot let them destroy another town. Then let's go, Gohan. No. Trunks still can't transform into a Super Saiyan. He's not ready for this fight yet. I'll be back. You stay here. Wait, Gohan. I can go with you and help you fight. You're still not ready to take them on. Just stay here for now. But, like, any help would be better than nothing, right, Gohan? Fine. But try to keep up, okay? And don't push it if you think it's too much. Thanks. There's only some way of knowing where they are. Hard to do that when we can't detect their energy. We're gonna have to hunt them down the hard way. That's enough, androids! How could you monsters do this? Oh, great. You guys again. What a drag. Let's get rid of them so we can keep having some fun. There are tons of other far more interesting people left to kill. I'm not gonna let you do that. Go on. Let me help you fight them. Fine. You can be my support, but try not to put yourself directly in harm's way. Uh, okay. I'm more than enough to handle these losers on my own. Try to make it snappy, okay? We've got places to be. One slip up and we're done for. You need to be careful, Trunks. Wait, here I come! <laughs> 
Let's see. <laughs> 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 Damn, you're annoying. Your reign of terror ends here and now. Come on, oh, Gohan. How much longer are you planning to keep this silly game up? Give it up already. You have to realize you're just delaying the inevitable. Shut up. I won't let Piccolo, Krillin, and everyone else's deaths be for nothing. They and the rest of the planet are counting on me. It's, it's because of them that I could do this. Go on. <sighs> I guess we have no other choice but to show you just how far out of our league you are. How long are you gonna keep babysitting the brat? You're gonna be in real trouble if you don't start taking us more seriously. Yeah! I'm gonna beat you! Then fight us for real. We're not gonna lose. All right, I'll fight you. I guess you can fight, kind of. I've trained long and hard to avenge those you've killed. Not yet. There's still a long way to go before they're done. Ah! Trunks! Hm. You thought you were winning? Give me a break. It's lights out for you guys. <laughs> well, would you look at that? At least they're good at running away. They're pretty nimble for a couple of meat bags. <sighs> Wherever you're hiding, we'll find you. So, you think we got them, 18? Yeah, they're dead. But even if they are alive, we'll find them. Come on, 17. Let's get out of here. Hmm. Okay, sure.
This is my last Sensu Bean Trunks. You take it. You're our last hope, Trunks. <laughs>